the mother. My holy mother of all the mothers in the yeah. whole motherland. What up, YouTube fam? It's April G. Showers back at y'all with a reaction. NF has dropped a new one. Nobody even told me. I was scrolling through YouTube a while ago and Crip. Dropped a new video called NF's new album track list. And I was like, did NF drop a new album? Went to NF's channel and I saw he dropped this song. So this song must be on that new album. And I am so excited. I am going to have to pause it a whole, whole, whole lot. So hopefully, hopefully this does not get blocked those of you who know me know NF is in my top five. And when I tell people that, you could go watch just about any and all of the interviews I've done. I've done 14 different interviews with different artists slash some of them are reactors as well. Did an interview with Crypt. And when I say NF is in my top five, I get the same look and or response. Really? What? You know, and it's not that they don't like NF. It's just either A, they haven't listened to much of his music, or, you know, they just have their own reasons. But I love NF. My little brother who passed away from brain cancer is who introduced me to NF. Now, that's not the reason I put him in my top five. He's in my top five because this dude is talented. He can rap, rap, fast or slow. His storytelling ability is a top tier. I mean, have you heard How Could You Leave Us? One of my favorite songs of all time. I ball every time I hear it. I ball when I reacted to it when I first started my channel a little over three years ago. And I could talk about it forever. NF can sing. I mean, he's just multi-talented. I saw a, a tweet he put out to email about being in a video because he was going to be in Nashville. And I'm so sad because that's right up the road from where I live, Nashville is, and I'm on bed rest because of my health, unfortunately, so I'm not going to be able to go, and I'm so, ah, uh, I'm so upset about that, but he's another one I got to see in concert before I die, got to, but anyway, I'm shutting up, but like I said, I am going to have to pause it a lot, because YT has been tripping, tripping, tripping lately on us music reactors. And I just got to be careful. As always, I will provide the link in the description box. So please be sure to click on that link. Go watch it. Like, comment, share, subscribe. All that wonderful stuff. It's five minutes and three seconds. Yay. And I'm so excited. All right, y'all. April G. Score. This book. Love y'all. Let's get it. I'm so excited. Oh. Yeah, I'm on my way. I'm coming. Don't, don't lose faith in me. What I tell y'all, he can sing. I know you've been waiting. I know you've been praying for my soul. Oh. The anticipation, the build-up, you, you hear it in the background with the music. He said, Hope, I'm on my way, I'm coming, I know you've been waiting for me, I know you've been praying for me. Looks like it's him sitting alone in the middle of the daggone ocean. Let's go. Thirty years you've been dragging your feet, telling. Hold up, he's wearing white. That's different. Normally he's in all black and or gray. Okay, NF is huge with symbolism. 
by the way, huge. So, you see he's a law. You see he's an all white instead of black or gray. So, okay. 30 Love that. Years. Love that piano. Sorry. 30 years you've been dragging your feet Telling me I'm the reason we're stagnant Ooh. 30 years you've been claiming your honesty and promising progress Well, where is he that? Woo! Woo! 30 years you've been dragging your feet Telling me I'm the reason we're stagnant 30 years You've been claiming your honest and promising progress. Well, where's it at? This is fire. We're all ready. 30 years you've been dragging your feet, telling me I'm the reason we're stagnant. 30 years you've been claiming your honest and promising progress. Well, where's it at? I don't want you to feel like a failure I know this hurts But I gave you your chance to deliver Now it's my turn Woo! 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 <laughs> I love it so much! I gave you your chance to, to deliver, now it's my turn And he stands up, the all-white NF stands up Chance to deliver Now it's my turn Don't get me wrong Woo! Nature had the great ride Woo! That reminds me of, uh, Imagine Dragons The way he, he's Nature had a great ride Believer You know what I'm talking about? I love Imagine Dragons, one of my favorite bands one of my son's favorite bands. Uh, NF is one of my son's favorites too, by the way. he my, NF is in my son's top five too. Just saying. Now it's my turn. Don't get me wrong. Nature had a great one. But it's time to give the people something different. Woo! So without further ado, I like to introduce my my album, my album, my album, my album, my album, my album. Hope. Okay, okay. His new album's called Hope. When does it come out? Hold up, NF new album release, April. The seventh hope, folks, and I will be reacting to every single song. And I do have an NF reactions playlist here on my channel with everything I've ever reacted to by NF in it. If y'all want to check it out, I'm excited. And then, but he said, I want to introduce my, and then they said, my album, album, out, and, and it was like. Both of the NFs saying, my album, my album, no, my album. Like the dressed in all white NF and the dressed in all black NF, you know what I'm saying? Like to introduce my, my album, 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 my album. Hope. Woo! Definition of success. Woo! Listening to what your heart says. That's from one of his songs. It was on the search. I have all his albums. <laughs> I do have all of NF's albums. Um, why? The song Why starts out like that. What's my definition of success? But pretty sure he don't ever give us the definition of success <laughs> in that song. He talks about his, how he's feeling and, and his, his pride. Anyway, it's a great song. If you haven't heard the song Why by NF, W-H-Y, highly, highly recommend listening to it. Hope. What's my definition of success? Listening to what your heart says. Yeah! 
Standing up for what you know is Rival everybody else is Fucking the tub between their legs Woo! Standing up for what's right When everyone else is Tucking their tail between their legs and also going with what your heart says. This is fire. So this is like a positive motivational type song and I love it. For what you know is is what will everybody else says is in the tub between their legs. What's my definition of success? Creating something no one else can. Being brave enough to dream big, big. Dreaming when you're told to just quit, quit. Giving more when you got nothing left. Something never never. Ooh, there he is. There's the all black NF. This is making me cry. I needed to hear this. NF always makes me cry, bruh. Whether it's positive or sad, I always end up shedding tears at least a little bit. I can't help it. I needed this. Definition of success Creating something no one else can Being brave enough to dream big Dreaming when you're told to just quit Giving more when you got nothing left It's a person that'll take a chance on Something that we're talking never happen It's a person that can see the bright side Through the dark times when there ain't one Yes! It's a person that can see the bright side Through the dark times when there ain't what when there ain't one could never happen it's a person that can see the bright side through the dark times when they're through the dark times when there ain't one <laughs> when you're told to just quit quit giving more when you got nothing left it's a person that'll take a chance on something that we're talking never happen it's a person that can see the bright side through the dark times when there ain't one it's Never had nothing in the fade to walk away from more profit because they rather do something that they really love and take the pay cut. It's a person that would never waver or change who they are just to try and gain some credibility so they can feel accepted by a stranger. This is fire. This is fire. Somebody who will never change who they are just so they can feel accepted by a stranger. And something about a pay cut. Go back. Don't like it. No, this is. There ain't one. It's when someone who ain't never had nothing ain't afraid to walk away from more profit because they'd rather do something that they really love and take the pay cut. Something who, someone who ain't afraid to walk away from. Hold on, how did he say it? Afraid to walk away from more profit. Someone who ain't afraid to walk away from more profit because they'd rather do something they really love than take a pay cut. Let's go bruh this is phenomenal oh i'm so excited for his album dark times when there ain't one it's when someone who ain't never had nothing ain't afraid to walk away from more profit because they rather do something that they really love and take the pay cut it's a person that would never waver or change who they are just to try and gain some credibility so they can feel accepted by a stranger it's a person that can take the fears in their life and turn them into motivation it's believing Take your failures in life and turn them into motivation. Believing in yourself when no one else does. Come on, both of I love this. This is so amazing. Credibility so they can feel accepted by a stranger. It's a person that can take the fears in their life and turn them into motivation. It's believing in yourself when no one else does. It's amazing. What a little bit of faith can do if you don't even believe in you. Why Woo! would you think or expect anybody else that's around you to? Yeah. I didn't did things that I regret. Yeah. I didn't said things I can't take back. Yeah. Was a lost soul at a crossroad who had no hope, but I changed. Woo! Holding on to things I never should have kept full of hatred. Years of my life carrying a lot of baggage that I should have walked away from. Oh, I should have done paused it. Please, YouTube, don't block this, bruh. Please. Ugh. This is so amazing. Oh, and it's so inspiring and motivational and just what I needed to hear. I've been so depressed. Being stuck in this bed. <sighs> Thank you, NF.
you too. I done did things that I regret. I done said things I can't take back. Was a lost soul at a crossroad who had no hope, but I changed that. I spent years of my life holding on to things I never should have kept full of hatred. Years of my life carrying a lot of baggage that I should have walked away from. Years of my life wishing I was someone different looking for some validation. Years of my life trying to fill a void pretending I was someone. They get it. Woo -hoo -hoo. Oh, dang. All black and F just pushed the crap out of all white and F and he fell through. Is that the mansion? Hold up. Away from years of my life wishing I was someone different looking for some validation. Years of my life trying to fill up for pretending I was in them. They get it. He said they get it and then pushed him so the all black that's the one who said they get it. Like they they understand and pushed him like shut up. Had enough of your positive crap. Come on, bruh. Yes, mansion and serious is blind deception. Come on. What's really Evil, difficult to go through, yes, but beneficial. Woo! So it's everything you're meant to break down as a negative thing, which I want him to agree. Ooh, that's flow. He done switched up the whole ish. Ooh, ooh, fire. And I, he's in the mansion. I was right. Mansion. Pains are necessary, evil, difficult to go through, yes, but beneficial. Some would say having a mental breakdown is a negative thing, which I want him to agree, but on the other hand, it was the push I needed to get help and start the healing process. See if I didn't ever hit my bottom, would I be the person that I am today? I don't believe so. I'm a Facts. I'm a recovering addict. I'll celebrate 12 years clean on August the 8th. And had I never hit rock bottom and got to that place of desperation, I would still be high today or dead. One of the two. No question in my mind. I had to hit rock bottom. And he says something about uh, people think like a mental breakdown is a negative thing. And on one hand, I agree. But on the other hand, it was that push that I needed. Come on, bro. The metaphorical push that I needed, but also the literal, the dark side of him pushed him in the video. Come on, bro. This is fire, bro. It's the push that I needed to get help. And all of it made me who I am today. Facts. Y'all better stop sleeping on it, Elf, and start putting some respect on his name. Let's go. Necessary evil, difficult to go through. Yes, but beneficial. Some would say having a mental breakdown is a negative thing, which I want him to agree. But on the other hand, it was the push I needed to get help and start the healing process. See if I didn't hit my bottom, would I be the person that I am today? I don't believe so. I'm a perfect example of what happens when you choose to not accept defeat and face your demons. To yes. To realize that if you want to get the opportunity to be the greatest version of yourself, sometimes you gotta be someone and not to hear the voice of reason. Having kids will make you really take a step back and look in the mirror. At least for me, that's what it did. I Up every day and pick my son up, hold him in my arms and let him know he's loved. Love standing by the window, questioning if that <laughs> my son is the reason I went to rehab. He's 15 now, and I went to rehab when he was three. I woke up and I looked at him. He was asleep. He slept with me when he was that little, and he was asleep. And I thought, April, what are you doing? Your son's gonna wake up in bed with you one day and find his mom dead. And he don't have a father in his life. You're all he's got. <sighs> and I, before I even got out to bed, I called rehab. That was Friday, August 5th, 2011. And then Sunday, August 7th, 2011, I went to rehab. And then Monday, August 8th, 2011 is my clean date. And I've been clean ever since. And it's not been easy.
at all. At all. But somehow, by the grace of God, I've been able to do it. And if I could do it, anybody could do it. If NF could do it, anybody could do it. You don't have to have kids to be able to do it. Do it for you. You deserve it. You're not alone. You're not worthless. NF, this is brilliant. I knew NF got married and had a son. And I'm so happy for him. I'm so happy for him. Let's go. I am today, I don't believe so. I'm a perfect example of what happens when you choose to not accept defeat and fashion demons. Took me 30 years to realize that if you want to get the opportunity to be the greatest version of yourself, sometimes you gotta be someone and not to hear the voice of reason. Having kids will make you really take a step back and look in the mirror. At least for me, that's what it did. I Up every day and pick my son up, hold him in my arms and let him know he's loved. Love standing by the window, questioning if that is ever going to show up. Up isn't something he's that's reference. To how could you leave us? I'm so sorry about your mother, NF. I'm know he's loved. Love standing by the window, questioning if that is ever going to show up. Up isn't something he's gonna have to worry about. Don't get it twisted, that was in a shot. Mama, I forgive you. I just don't want him to grow up thinking that he'll never be enough. 30 years of running, 30 years of searching, 30 years of hurting, 30 years of pain, 30 years of fearful, 30 years of anger, 30 years of empty, 30 years of shame, 30 years of broken, 30 years of anguish, 30 years of. It was 30 years for me, too, bro. I was 30 when I went to rehab. I promise. <laughs> He said that wasn't a shot. I forgive you, mama. Come on, bruh. Love standing by the window questioning if that is ever going to show up. Up isn't something he's gonna have to worry about. Don't get it twisted. That wasn't a shot. Mama, I forgive you. I just don't want him to grow up thinking that he'll never be enough. 30 years of running, 30 years of searching, 30 years of hurting, 30 years of pain, 30 years of fearful, 30 years of anger, 30 years of empty, 30 years of shame, 30 Woo! years of broken, 30 years of anguish, 30 years of hopeless, 30 years of hate, 30 years of never, 30 years of maybe, 30 years of later, 30 years of fate, 30 Rains. Woo! Oh my gosh! Mad you told to just quit. Oh! That was amazing! Ooh! Ooh! Oh! The whole... The whole thing was phenomenal. The video per usual was phenomenal but i love that that 30 years of uh 30 years of uh 30 year and just oh uh, and i can relate so much and i know so many other people out there can relate as well he is top tier that's why he's in my top five if y'all can't see why he's in my top five i don't know what to tell you i love this so much and i needed it oh my goodness how bad i needed to hear this amazing i'm so happy for you nf i know you'll probably never see this but i'm so happy for you and proud of you and so excited for his album oh my goodness i'm gonna react to every single song just like I did with Clouds. I think I reacted to every song on Clouds. I think I reacted to all of them except for one, maybe. Anyway, I know I reacted to... I either reacted to all of them or all of them except for one. It's, they're all in my NF Reactions playlist. But I love this. This was inspirational, motivational, phenomenal. Just... Every day you can want in a song. Oh, uh, holy mother of all the mothers in the whole motherland. Loved it. I can't wait for this album, bruh. I've got to see him in concert before I die. <sighs> Y'all, sorry. 
y'all comment below y'all thoughts what do y'all think of the song the lyrics the video my reaction can y'all relate be real be respectful please but be real please like this video on your way out a lot more important to you you think and please subscribe to my channel y'all all right y'all april g squad fist bump love y'all and i'll see y'all in just a little bit peace out